Wow, this question looks fun to solve. Given to us are two circles and a quadrilateral. The distance of opposite vertex of this quadrilateral from the center of blue circle is given as 3 and 4 cm. Exciting part is with this limited data, we have to find the radius of this blue circle. Let's check this amazing solution. So here we'll be using few theorems. The first one with respect to this purple circle A, B, C, D is a cyclic quadrilateral and by theorem the opposite angles of cyclic quadrilateral are supplementary. So here this angle D plus angle B is 180. If angle D is 2 alpha then angle B it will be 180 minus 2 alpha. The second theorem with respect to this blue circle from an external point D two tangents are drawn and by theorem the line joining this point D to the center will bisect the angle formed at this point. So DO will bisect angle D here or this partial angle that will be half of 2 alpha or alpha degree. Same logic here this partial angle will be half of 180 minus 2 alpha or 90 minus alpha. Now let's draw the radius of this blue circle and this radius is perpendicular to the tangent at point of tangency. Same way OF will be perpendicular to CB. Now in this triangle BFO, it's a right angle triangle. This angle is 90 and this is 90 minus alpha. By angle sum property, this angle here that will be alpha degrees. Now if you look carefully in this yellow triangle, and this pink triangle. We have got angle 90 and alpha in both of them. So by angle angle similarity, this yellow triangle is similar to this pink triangle. As these triangles are similar, thus ratio of corresponding sides will be equal. So here we get AO upon DO that will be equal to FB upon OB. And here your EO length that is R do length that is 3 so r by 3 is equals to fb now this pink triangle is an right angle triangle and fb length will be by pythagoras theorem root of 4 square minus r square so putting fb as root of 4 square minus r square and your ob length that is 4 now this is equation in variable r to solve it let's square both the side LHS will be R square by 3 square. RHS that will be this square root will get cancelled and denominator will be 4 square. Now let's divide this 4 square by 4 square here. So we get this RHS as 1 minus R square by 4 square. Let's take all the terms with R on the left side. So we get R square by 3 square plus R square by 4 square is 1. So taking here denominator as 9 times 16, we get 25 R square upon 9 times 16 is 1. Simplifying it, R square is 9 times 16 is 144 by 25. R is 12 by 5 or R is 2.4 centimeter and that's our answer. I hope you enjoyed the solution. I will see you in next video. Till then, tata, bye bye.